Smash Ultimate has now been out for 5 whole years, and with each character comes a unique moveset that varies in terms of utility, strength, and practicality. While some are pretty bad, other moves are incredibly viable. So in this video, I'll be getting a kill with every character's best move in Smash Ultimate. This list mainly references the decisions of Mock Rock's video, Every Character in Smash Ultimate's Best Move, as I see it being the most accurate and in-depth video covering the best part of each character's kit. So please, check that out if you're interested in why these moves in this video were chosen. However, there are some things I do change for the sake of it being an Echo Fighter or for the sake of content, like I'm not going to do all 21 of Hero's spells, I already did that for a video. But with that being said, I hope you enjoy. Alright, I got a fresh new account. You're getting a kill with the best moves for each character in Smash Ultimate. And to start off with Mario, Mario. it's up air. The decisions for these moves mainly follows Mock Rock's video. I did take some creative liberty in switching it up a little bit for some of the Echo Fighters. Uh, one example is actually going to be Samus and Dark Samus. It's only a few things. And then for Hero, obviously Hero's Spellbook is, is his best move. I'm not going to do that uh, because it's, you know, 21 separate moves and I've already done an entire video on that. No, I ran into that. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. Quesadilla, you've gotten the best of me. Oh, wait, that was actually kind of sick. I don't know if that can, I don't know if that was it. God, do I already have to check the footage? I already have to check the footage. That's unreal. Yeah, I think that counts. I, I don't know what other movie it would have been. So I, I'm gonna I'm gonna say that counted. And now we have DK. DK's glorious cargo throw. And it's not just his cargo throw, it's his forward cargo throw. Oh, you wanna spin? I could spin better, bitch. Okay. And there we go, we already have it. And I'm dead. <laughs> well, um, that was incredibly quick. I figured it was gonna be, because it's DK. We love our glorious king, my Pookie Bear. Oh, shit. Okay, Gil, my turn. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit. Okay, Link. Although his up B and Nair might be his best. So I think I'm going to deviate a little bit from the reference video here. And I'm going to say instead of his down B being his best move, I'm probably going to switch it up and give it to Nair. Um, actually, you know what? Let's just go for down B while we're at it. Why not? Despite Link being one of the biggest IPs for Smash. I have not played him at all, so I'm glad we got that out of the way pretty quick. I mean, whether you call Link's down B or neutral air his best move, I got both of them. So, yay. On to the next one. Like I said earlier, there are a few Echo Fighters that have the same decision, such as Dark Samus and Samus and Peach and Daisy. For them, I decided to switch it up a little bit. For Samus, I'm gonna go with the traditional neutral B being the charge shot because it is absolutely fucking ridiculous. And with Dark Samus, I decided to go for a back throw because as much as I love, uh, you know, down B, I think the back throw is just so funny. There we go, give me it. Yes! Okay, we got neutral B. Wow, this is going kinda quick. And now we have Dark Samus, which I don't know why they added them into the game, but they are a really cool character. How does Dark Samus fit into the lore? Aren't they like a parasite or something? Also, it's a rematch. They also must really like Persona, because we've gotten this stage twice now. Dark Samus is such a cool character though, like, I'm surprised they didn't give them an entirely new moveset. Like, I think this is the closest you can get to a true Echo Fighter. I can't say that because Daisy exists. What is this? What is this stage? Oh! oh! <laughs> that was such a sick combo. Oh my god, you thought he could get me with that? That's so good. Oh, I love how smooth my brain is. Oh god. <laughs> I'm not excited to start playing Yoshi. Okay, so for Yoshi, this godforsaken character, the move we're going for is back air, and we're playing against Yoshi Pro 64. Playing Yoshi in my pastime is probably my favorite activity. I can't think of a, of a thing more exciting than, than playing Yoshi in Smash Brothers Ultimate. Out of the entire roster, Yoshi. Which is a shame because Yoshi in Mario Kart is goaded. You're still not dead. That's ridiculous. And he countered that. Oh my god. There we go. Thank you. Finally. Jesus. Alright. And with Kirby, it's forward air. 
not that surprising considering it's literal combo food. Oh my god, that is hilarious. He was edge guarding me and I just happened to get that. Ooh, that's embarrassing, man. Yeah, I don't know what that's like. You're not SDing. Can't be me. There we go. Got him. Got him. Can I move around like every other Fox player? Oh my god, guys. Guys, oh my god, look at me. Can you tell I'm a Fox player? I'm dash dancing. You like that? A hero. I don't see too many of them online. There we go. Up smash. Easy. Yeah. Okay, I have a lot of ground to make up against this guy, but he's getting some ridiculous hits on me. So, probably not. Oh, God. Dude, I don't understand these hits. Oh, my God. I'm already... I'm getting tilted. And it's like, I only have to play Fox once. I don't get it. I don't get it. Pikachu, Pikachu, Pikachu. The thick rat. Oh, his best move is uh, neutral B. Uh, that's going to be a little hard to get against the Bowser Jr., however. Because they have a... Good recovery. I think this one is a, uh, a lost cause because I think I need to get somebody with a kind of bad recovery. Oh, never mind. We got it right there. Jesus, that was <laughs> that was incredibly lucky. Oh yeah, I think he I think he turned off his switch. No, I need my glorious GSP. All right, well on to Luigi. And to nobody's surprise, down throw is his best move. It is incredibly good for no reason. It's a really good combo starter, and I've actually played against this guy in my getting a kill with every Pyra move. So I'm glad I get a rematch against a, another Sonic. It makes me feel so great about myself. There's nothing more I would like to do on my weekend than play against a Sonic in Smash Brothers Ultimate. All right, three minutes to try and time out the Sonic. Man, this will be a, a true accomplishment if I uh, time out a Sonic. No, me, I'm gonna choke a big time in sudden death. Yes, we're going to sudden death, baby. Okay, can I get down throw on this? No, no, the shield poke. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Oh, Falco. Oh, man. Well, at least it's five minutes. What kind of, what kind of rule set are you on, man? Yeah, 300% is probably a safe bet for this guy, right? He loves shielding and grabbing, so I'm, I'm taking advantage of that right now. Dude, why do you keep shielding? Oh, this guy's this guy's so funny. He's such a guy, you know? He's such a, such a little guy. As long as he doesn't SD, we're, we're chilling, man. Um, hmm. Oh, there we go. I didn't think that was going to kill. Well, there we go. We got Luigi's down throw, which is not that... I thought it was going to be a lot worse. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep it real. 10 down, 70 to go. So for Ness, it is his uh, his side... No, not side B. What am I saying? It's his down B. And it does have a hitbox where I can actually get a kill. Oh, no! My God! <laughs> oh, that's painful. What's up, gamers? One hour into the challenge. Okay, I could definitely get it on, on Little Mac. Back throw. He's going to... Do this. There we go. Got it. Alrighty. Wow. I feel bad because it was against a little Mac, you know. Oh, this is a horrible matchup for him, isn't it? Oh, my lord. Oh, I got it again. Dude, what? That is crazy. Captain Falcon, probably the most hyped character in the game. I don't think there's much of a dispute for that. His uh, best move, according to Mock Rock, is his Nair. Okay. Oh my god, I keep- Oh, no way, I just did that. There we go, finally got it. Now I can actually try and win this instead of spamming Nair. <laughs> so, despite Puff, you know, Puff's side beat kind of being crazy, down air is allegedly her best move. Well, there we go, I got it. That was kind of an unorthodox way of getting it, considering it's more of a uh, setup move for rest, but I just figured I could edge guard him or, you know, take the beating from the hub B. So now after completing the first row, we move on to Peach, which is an interesting one because her best move according to Mock Rock, isn't necessarily a move. It's her ability to float. To accommodate this, this technique, I figured I would get a kill while using float. So whether that's forward air, back air, doesn't really matter. As long as I am floating or was floating in the motion of it, then I think it counts. <laughs> and I should absolutely be able to get it on it in the center roar. Oh, well, there we go. I got forward air while floating. 
<laughs> oh man. Okay, well, um, then on to Daisy. Because she's an Echo Fighter, I decided that I should switch it up a little bit, um, which I think is fair. I think her turnips are some of the most useful projectiles in the entire game, so I want to be able to, you know, get a kill with that. Am I dead? I'm dead. That's that's embarrassing. Now that's embarrassing. A nether incineroar? <laughs> what the what the hell? A nether incineroar? Dude, that's three in a row. Alright, well <laughs> that that does count because I did hit him. The last move <laughs> was with the turnip. So alright. Well, I guess that was kind of anticlimactic. Oh, on to uh King Koopa now. I'm not doing- Oh my god, another Sonic, dude. I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna lose my mind if I have to play against another Sonic. So Bowser's best move is his side B. So I'm gonna go for that on stage and off stage just because I'm a dick. I, does that count? Does that count? I don't know if that counts, does it? Well, we're gonna take him far, far away. So that one counted. I'm gonna try and get him on stage though. Huh. All right. We got Bowser side B. That's probably the easiest one we're gonna get the entire time, the entire challenge. Ice climbers. Now they they are weird. Ice climbers are incredibly weird. I believe their best move is the side B move here. It's called Squall Hammer, right? I really like the ice climbers, and I would actually really like to play them for a video because they are some of the most interesting characters in the entire franchise. I think they have some of the highest skill ceiling when it comes to actual like. Oh shit. When it comes to like potential, I think they have the highest like ceiling. A falcon. I can definitely get some cheese. Yeah? Yeah? Yo, I'm kind of getting some sick combos with these guys. Not really. <laughs> Does that count? <laughs> oh man, I feel like I shouldn't count that one, but that was literally the last move before he said Cowabunga. Come here. Oh. Oh. I thought that was the other one. Come back. No! I, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty funny. Got a sensible chuckle out of me. Just don't accidentally SD. There we go. That, that, I got it right there. I, 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 I'm just glad he didn't SD. I'm gonna be honest. But hey, we did it. So I'd be with Ices. Did not think that was actually gonna work out as well as it did. And now we have Sheik. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. Yeah, this is fine, to right? Like, totally, totally fine. Fortunately, it is one of her kill moves and not like a setup move. It is down B, uh, bouncing fish, which is great. I like playing greedy. I am kind of a, a greedy fellow when it comes to this game. So uh, we're gonna we're gonna try and uh, be a little of a, of, a, of, a, of a prick in this. I also do have experience playing Sheik because I got a kill with every one of her moves a while back. Uh, have I played her since? Absolutely not, but that's the beauty of it, right? There we go, so greedy. I'm glad I got that one pretty quick because I probably would have lost my mind going for that. So, I just want to say hi. Um, hope you're enjoying it so far. I hope you also are enjoying this ASMR I'm giving you. Um, we, we have Zelda up next and she is a character in Smash Brothers. Her uh, best move is uh, the Phantom. Um, anyways, uh, I don't know what that was about, but we're going against a Luigi, which should be pretty good to get the Phantom. You know, I, although I think down B is a great move in general, I, I would think up airs might be her best move, you know? Well, there we go. I think, uh, I think up airs are a close second. Like, that thing is stupid strong. Like, like, unbelievably strong. If Dr. Mario is like my, my guilty pleasure of a main, like, he is so bad, but I love playing him. He's just such a funny character to play. So, in this one, we need to get a kill with his neutral, which is his pill. It's actually, like, laughable how not good Doc is, but I think that's part of the reason why I like playing him. So, I just need to go a little earlier. That doesn't count, does it? That doesn't count. Does that count? Because, like, I hit him, but, like, it didn't do any damage to him, you know? Now, that's just, that's sad. I'm gonna be honest, I'm about to pop a blood vessel. Smashy bro, yes. Day two, I've taken a, quite a bit of a break. I don't think we're gonna be able to get this on Steve, but who knows? Last time I played was strictly for Mithra, so 
I'm a little rusty when it comes to the dock, but I just have no idea how I'm gonna get neutral. Oh? Oh? Chunk, could you be my savior? Ah, oh, that's awkward. Oh. Oh! Please. <laughs> Dude, no way that counts. That is awesome. Oh my god. He kind of just bounced off of it. It's been it's been a while since I made it progress. It's been it took me a while to get this one. That's all I'm trying to say. It, that's the crazy part. Well, now we have Pikachu. No, Pichu. We have Pichu. <laughs> this guy would rather SV than get killed by up air. That's crazy. Oh, there we go. We got up air off a stage spike. That's kind of what I wanted to go for because I didn't realize it was going to send straight up. I'm kind of stupid in that regard. But hey, that's that's awesome. So Falco's is definitely going to be difficult because his is up tilt. I don't really know how I'm going to get that. And a Meta Knight. You know what? That's okay because he is a lighter character. I could definitely get I could definitely get on, on, on a Meta Knight. Surely. Surely. There we go. Up tilt kill. Sweet. That, that only took me uh, uh, two games. Yeah, two games to get it. I thought that was actually going to be like near impossible to get. So I'm pretty happy that it got that. So Martha and Lucina, obviously they are almost exactly identical. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's the uh, the sweet spot of their sword. The tipper, I think is the main difference. Because I think, I think it's easier to get on Lucina if I'm not mistaken. But for Marth and Lucina, both of their best moves are forward air. However, I'm going to make it so that I'm getting forward air for Marth. And for Lucina, we'll be going for side B. I think side B is a really, really close second. Your name is Milk Toast too. How, how, how does that not like surprise me at all? Okay, now this is, oh my God. Why am I not getting my rule set at all? Oh, I don't know if that counted. I don't remember if, if I got forward air right there. I think I did. I don't know what I've done to anger the guy. Oh God. Oh my god, I don't know what I did to anger such such divine powers, such divine beings. We were just kids when we fell inside a never-ending cycle of nowhere high. I was just there, lost in your world. You were my favorite anime girl. In the neighborhood. Oh yeah, okay, so for Lucina, although forwarder is the best move, uh, she is an echo fighter of oh my god's milk toast again although forward air is her best move she is an echo fighter and i do think it would be better if we went for side b which i probably argue is oh my god is her second best move yeah there we go finally 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 oh my god i was just rambling right there i don't know what i was talking about oh god after the whole situation we're on young link whose best move is neutral air there we go. There we go. We got neutral our first game. For once, it's actually going my way. Probably because I'm not playing like a fucking idiot. <laughs> now we're on to Ganon. All right, we're on Big Daddy Ganon, whose best move is neutral air. Um, I would probably agree with this for the most part. <laughs> I definitely agree with this move. Basically, this whole fight is a uh, who has a C stick go burr moment. Oh, there we go. That's... That was easy. That oh, poor guy. Poor guy. I did the same exact thing to him twice. So Mewtwo, just like Samus, has a pretty good projectile in their neutral bees. So that is the move we're aiming for. Shadow Ball looks really sick, and we're going against Milk Toast yet again. Oh no way. No way I got that. 178 with Mewtwo. I literally have zero commentary that entire game. We're now on to Roy, who, believe it or not, just jab is apparently to be his best move. I would have thought it would have been side B just like all the other ones, but nope. So we're gonna we're gonna have to get some cheese on it for sure. Alright, day three. So we're currently like in between a third and a quarter of the way done. It's been it's been about a week since I played. So let's try and get the glorious jab. All right, this will be my last match, and then we're just going to move on, and, and we'll come back to Roy, because I'm going to be honest, I've spent probably two hours trying to get a kill with Roy, and get, getting a kill with this jab is pretty rough. 
All right, we're gonna move on to Krom. We'll come back to Roy. So this is now the way future. I am going back to Roy. I have to get a kill with this jab. Yes. Yes, we got it. Thank God. Oh my God, we got it. After so long, we finally got it. We now have Krom, whose best move is up air. I believe this one will be a lot easier to get. You know, I'm probably gonna end up interjecting Roy, like getting his jab at some point before Krom's, you know? For you guys, it'll be like no time has passed at all. But for me, it'll be many hours of trying to get Roy's jab. There we go, oh my God. Ooh, I was silent because I wasn't sure if I was actually gonna get that. But here we are, probably gonna lose again. Mr. Game & Watch has the best recovery in the game. So his best move is actually his up B because it can kill. We're gonna be going for his up B. I think I was kind of implied with his, uh, he has the best recovery in the game. Man, when was the, when was the last time I played Game & Watch? I think it might have been when I was doing my getting a kill with every judge roll. I, I actually learned to, to appreciate, the, the, you know, the god himself. Oh, wait, there we go. Oh, um, Meta Knight, his one is up air. <laughs> you know, the move that literally does not kill. Oh, I hit him, I hit him. Yes, yes, I don't care. That count, that count. Oh, thank God, that was the last move I hit him with. I'm done, I'm done with this godforsaken character. It was, it was so underwhelming, but it was in fact the last move. Pitt's best move is neutral air, which I think is a pretty, pretty justifiable argument. The one after this though is dark pit. And I'm gonna take some creative liberty in saying that his best move is actually going to be his side B. My opinion of Pitt is, is kind of interesting because I think he's like the perfect character when it comes to just being okay at everything. I, th I mentioned this before, but I think Wolf is the perfect top tier. I think he's dead. There we go, we got neutral air. It seems like I get the kills when I just stop talking. So maybe maybe that's the that's the move. As mentioned before, Dark Pit's best move, in my opinion, is side B. I think it'll be funny to get get a little a little side B. Maybe do the classic roll off the edge, get the side B kill. I'm just I'm just spamming it, man. Come on. Can you like let me have this or no? There we go, we finally got it. Okay, maybe there is hope for me after all. This is awesome. Well, now we have ZSS, who I think has one of the best spikes in the game. Their best move is flip kick. It is just so versatile, you know? It's, it's a really funny kill move that I can just get a spike with. So that's what we're going for. We could probably get on this guy. I can't tell you the last time I played ZSS, probably for that spike video that I did. Okay. Oh my God, that was beautiful. You know, I can't complain. That was that was so clean. And that's why I gave it an S tier spike on my on my video. Right, I'm gonna go for something sick. Um They they usually go low. Oh uh, okay, on to Wario. I don't think it shocks anyone that his best move is is waft. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna fart on some <laughs> okay. We're gonna fart on Bowser Jr. Wario is one of those characters that I have kind of like a newfound appreciation for because he kind of he kind of did did his he held his own uh, when I was doing my Nuzlocke and I thought it was pretty cool. That was actually one of the coolest things about doing the Nuzlocke was because characters that you don't normally play you kind of you kind of forced to play them and Wario was one of those characters. All right, we have Waft. We, we I see it. Our character Wario is now glowing. That luscious man, my glorious Pookie Bear. Oh, there we go. That was so clean. First game, too. Wow, I didn't think I was going to pop off for a character like Wario, but here we are. You know, guys, I don't I don't play well too often, but when I do, you know, that, that's, that's, it's pretty fun. It's pretty cool. So now we have the guy from Fortnite, and this one is actually kind of interesting because Snake has a lot of contenders for best move. So Mock Rock suggests that his neutral B is his best move. Others say it's his Nikita. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say his, his up tilt is probably his best move. It's just such a good move in general. But my goal in this one is to get a kill with his, his up tilt because to me that's his best move. There we go. There we go. 
<laughs> I was just spamming up to him. I'm sure you could hear that in the recording. So Ike also has a few really good moves that we can rock with. Um, his upbeat got buffed a while back, and that was a that, that is a good contender in my opinion. His forward air, you know, classic. His up air, classic. However, uh, I think the consensus is that his neutral neutral air is his best move. So we are going to try and get that. I don't know what percent his nair kills, so... <laughs> We're doing a forward tilt for Squirtle, which is going to be a, <laughs> a little ridiculous if you ask me. You know, I'm in a slightly better mood. Uh, maybe I was just hangry, you know? We are going to be doing this for every single one of Pokemon trainers. Pokemon. So Ivysaur and Charizard. Realistically, I could go for Ivysaur and Charizard's moves, but there's no fun in that, right? Doing it out of order. Oof. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. I give up. We're going up there. We're, we're going with Ivysaur first. There we go. Easy. That was that was the easiest one. So we get we got we got Ivysaur out of the way. We might be able to get Charizards as well, just because that'll be funny. Yeah, I didn't really talk about Ivysaur, but Ivysaur, to no surprise, is up air. And, uh, close contenders obviously going to be down air. Like that move is crazy. And for Charizard, th his move is gonna be back air. Easy, and we got Charizards. All right, well we got two in a row in that match. All we have left is Squirtle, so let's just focus on that, I guess. Oh, we're close. We are close, guys. I don't know. Do they have jumps? We got it. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, they ran out of jumps. That's amazing. Oh, I don't. I can die happy, man, now. We have Diddy Kong now. To the surprise of absolutely not one single individual. His best move is his banana. I don't know how we're going to get in. Okay, do this. Throw it. I hit him. Oh my god, it actually worked. That is complete luck. I did not think that was actually going to work. So I believe that Lucas is the only character that has a Zare as his best move. <laughs> Basically, we are going to we're gonna we're gonna try and get like a stupid little edge guard, maybe. Whoa! 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 Little Mac, guys, we might actually be able to get something. There we go. There we go immediately. It only took a little Mac for us to get Lucas's air. <laughs> Poor guy. Knowing me, I'm still gonna lose this though because my smooth ass brain can't handle a uh, little Max. Oh yeah, Sonic. So Sonic is a tie between, I think his neutral B and down B. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say his neutral B is his best move. I don't, what the fuck was that? Okay, an Incineroar, three minute timer. Oh, he's gonna live. There we go, we got neutral, we got neutral B. Thank God, I don't have to play any more fucking Sonic. Now we're on to King DDD, the fat fucking penguin. Some might think his Gordo is his best move, and you know, I would be kind of inclined to agree with that. However, the suck. That's right, King DDD's neutral B is his best move and you know what i think it's pretty close between the gordo going for it there we go easy easy we got it first time first time i'm pretty sure that was the quickest one we've had i'm gonna keep it honest i have lost way more games than i've won and it's only gonna get worse all of Mars best move is without a shadow of a doubt it, it's side b you could also argue up throw with specifically the blue pikmin so uh, the point is just, I guess, preference. Oh, fat boy. Yes. He is kind of thick, guys. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, I think that counts. Oh, my God. Because, <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Now I can actually try and win. Imagine if I actually win with all of my... Um, next is Lucario. Yeah. <laughs> Min Min? <laughs> okay. So Lucario's best move is neutral B. This kind of makes sense considering his, uh, his aura. Like, obviously his whole gimmick is that he's supposed to take damage. It makes sense that his best move is, is neutral B because it's also like, kind of like Samus's. It's, it's just one of the best projectiles in the game. Oh. We got it. <laughs> I, I love playing Rob. 
So I'm happy about that. Rob's neutral air is actually his best move, which I think is pretty fair. I can't really argue with that. My my other one that I would suggest could be side B or even even back air. Come here. No, <laughs> they detected that. No, <laughs> they're actually so good. Let me kill you. There we go. Finally, finally got neutral air. Toon Link is up next, and his best move is his downbeat, which are the projectiles. We've actually played against this fucker. Um, oh my god, what just happened? I did not mean to do that. Oh, that was so sick. Oh my god. Oh my god, guys, I'm actually popping off. That might actually be the best thing I've done. Wolf. Who I've said many times before is the perfect top tier character. His best move is forward air. I think you can make a, a few arguments um, for for numerous types of moves. Some smash attacks, some tilts. I think his tilts are pretty gnarly. There we go. I got it. Oh my god, that was that was. I went really far for that one. All right, villager. Yeah. Uh, oh, Luki. Oh, oh, we'll be fine. Uh, the move we're going for is forward air. Forward air, back air, it's basically the same move. So that move, or this one is just entirely up to your preference. All right, well, we got him. Sweet. That, that one's going to be the quickest. We did that in 40 seconds. Mega Man is, uh, the lemons. I think that's, an, is that neutral air? I don't know how I'm going to get killed with this. We're going to need somebody with a really bad recovery. Yeah, his best move, is, according to Mock Rock, is the Lemons. I don't know about that one, but I've never tried getting a kill with this move, so... Also, I don't really play Mega Man. Get out of here. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, well, that was it. That's kind of just how I envisioned getting it. There's nothing more to that, so... Uh... <laughs> Uh, on to the next character, I guess. All right, so for those of you who don't know, I'm actually a Wii Fit main. There's zero surprise to me that her side B is her best move. So um, we're gonna we're gonna cook, hopefully. Okay, he does want the rematch. Sick. What is going on? I don't really understand what's happening. Why why is this happening? What is going on right now? I literally have no clue what's happening. Dude, I hate this because I am 100%. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, God. Uh, you're going to hear me complain <laughs> about how much I hate Sora. Oh, that's embarrassing. That's so embarrassing. That can't be me. Now, Rosalina and Luma, who I deemed the, I think it was like the fourth most obscure character in the game. Their best move is actually neutral air. There's just kind of a funny move. This is this is a funny move. I like this move. <laughs> it's such a weak hitbox. I'm just so floaty. <laughs> this is so funny for no reason. Oh, why are you teabagging, man? That's kind of embarrassing. That's really embarrassing. And I say that as I die. All right, let's try. Let's try and win this one now since he's teabagging. I have no idea what day it is so long time viewers of my channel know that i am one greedy son of a bitch and i'm gonna be incredibly greedy going for little max side b oh i'm about to punch this kid in the face oh he doesn't have a jump going for it yes you know i thought i was really cool for that I'll, i'm gonna be completely honest that was kind of underwhelming so that means we're like just under two thirds of the two oh god we're just under two thirds of the way down so greninja greninja's best move is actually his dash attack which i think is kind of an interesting choice do i agree with the choice i don't know i don't play enough greninja to have an opinion like that i could definitely see this move being like a really good setup move and that's why it's considered his best move however it's so awful to get just going for dashes just going for dashes does that count Oh my god, he just SD'd. Why? Why? I'm counting that. I am going to count that. 
why, why, why? I don't know who you are, my hero, but you've saved me so much time and effort. And for that, I thank you. So we have Palatina, whose best move is back air. Would I agree with this one? Probably. This one's pretty good. Like, out of all the back airs, I think hers and Corrin's are probably what I think of as the best. Hers is just so good. It's, it's either that or, or Nair. Like, it is equally good. No, I wanted back air so bad. Oh my god. I just want back air. I just want it. I just want back air so bad. There we go. Finally got back air. I forgot about the Miis. The Miis were supposed to go after Greninja and before Palutena. So we'll do that right now. Samus. Okay. Um. So we're rocking the default Miis and Mii Brawler's best move uh, is just Nair. <laughs> Obviously, you can do like a wild amount of moves, but not switching the, the preset at all. Uh, this is their best move. So we're going to try and get that. Get out of here. I'm going for it. Yes, I don't care. I died. It was worth it. Me Sword Fighter. Their best move is up air. Um, part of their default kit, making no changes to it. Dude, how do you, how do you S D S Z S S? There we go, finally got upper. Me Gunner's best move is not neutral. Actually, forward air. There we go, finally. Oh, thank God, now I can actually just end my suffering here. Thank you. Oh, I still have like 30 left. Pac-Man, you would say his bonus fruit is his best move, and I would agree. I did an entire video getting a kill with every single one of his bonus fruits, so I'm going to not do that because I already, you know, did that. But instead, I'm going to say his fire hydrant is his second best move, and that's the one that we're going to be going for. Just going to be fishing for it pretty much. Never mind, we got it instantaneously. All right, Robin's best move is Arc Fire, side B. I think that is up for debate. Oh, no, that's gonna kill super early. Oh my god, especially if I get snipes like that. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay, uh, we take those, I guess. I don't think I'm gonna win this. <laughs> it is day whatever. I woke up sick. So instead of heading into my lab to do research, we are, well, playing Smashy Bros yet again. Shulk's best move, to nobody's surprise, is his Monado Arts, which is his neutral B. There are so many different types of things you can get with it. Oh, uh, awkward. There we go, we finally got it. Smash Monado completed. When it comes to the, each Monado art, it, it, you know, it's up to preference, really, which you think is the best. Some would argue Buster is the best. Some would argue Smash is the best. Uh, Bowser Jr., his best move is Side B. Oh, it, it definitely could be a kill move for, for a dog. There we go. Sweet, we got it. That was that was immediate. Wow, you know we we take those, we take those, and we and we and we take those in stride. <sighs> Can we pull out the win with Bowser Jr.? Next character, Duck Hunt. All right. Oh, Duck Hunt's best move is Neutral B. Okay, I, I that does not surprise anyone, does it? <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, I just fished for that the entire game. I have zero commentary because it's it's Marth and. You know, it's just fun. Oh no. Okay, this one might take a while. So Ryu's best move is down tilt. It's his down tilt. So despite me playing Terry like decently well, uh, it's a little awkward for me because I don't really know how to play Ryu. I can play the other ones decently well. Oh my God, I thought I had it. Oh, I do. <laughs> oh my god, so maybe you just spam down tilt and it works out. Say, all right. I thought that was going to take me forever, but we got that immediately. I remember at the beginning of Ultimate's life when Ken was one of the worst characters in the game. And then they buffed his uppie, which I thought was sick. So we need to get a kill with his glorious uppie. Please. No. <laughs> oh, he saved me. Well, I guess that does that count? 
Oh, well, there we go. So if I didn't get it before, I definitely got it then. Oh, yeah. Cloud, Cloud's best move is back air. There we go. Back air immediately. Okay. Um, on the first stock. I don't know what's going on. I'm not winning these matches, by the way. I'm Most of the time, I'm losing them. But at least I'm getting them in the first match. Now we're moving on to probably the most underrated character, in my opinion. Now, Corrin has a few really good moves. One of the contenders, in my opinion, is back air. However, I think Corrin does have one of the best up airs in the game. So, we're going to be going for that. Ooh, I thought that was it. I thought that was going to be it. Maybe I should do a falling up air. There we go. We got it. That was kind of a, a riskier play. They could have just exposed me right there. But hey, we got it. I mean, I'm kind of on a roll right now. So Bayonetta is interesting because her best move is side B, specifically in the air. What? What's he doing? Why? What? Why? 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 No, come here. Oh, I got him with side B. <laughs> Does that count? He just stopped in the middle of it. He just gave up. Technically, that counts. I chased him down to the bottom of the stage. So we're going to move on. <laughs> and now we're going to have back air for inkling. Back air. Yes. Oh, finally it took me like five minutes in that match to get it, but I got it. Sweet, 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 sweet. Now we have the character that's too big for Smash. Ridley's best move is actually his side tilt. Okay, Samus, Samus. Why'd you choose that color though? That color's ugly. I I'm pretty much there. Well, that, that was kind of anticlimactic. For Simon and Richter, I changed both of them. One, because Richter's an Echo Fighter, and two, I don't know if I fully agree with Side B being their best move. It's a good move, don't get me wrong, but I think Neutral B is way better of a move. I'm gonna inject my own judgment here, and for Simon, we're gonna be trying to get a kill with his Neutral B. And then for Richter, we're gonna go for his up B, because I think their up B's funny. Oh my god, so close. Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay, we got it immediately. All right, sweet. So we got we, we already finished the, the match with Simon, and now we're on to Richter. It's quite literally the same exact character. Obviously, there are a few contenders for what is their best move. Side B, neutral B, as we just saw, the holy water. So I'm going for up B just because I can. I just want to get this one combo. There we go. That's all I wanted. So K. Rool has you know, like a surplus of really good moves. There's side B, there's neutral B, there's down smash. I think a lot of people um, agree that probably neutral air is his best move, um, just because he gets a, the armor, uh, I believe, on that. There we go. Finally got it. Unfortunately, we have Isabella next. Because we did villagers forward air, I'm going to say we're going to go for Isabella's back air. There we go, we got back air. Oh my god, we're getting on the first match nearly every time. I don't know what it is today. Maybe it's, maybe it's the fact I'm not feeling well, but who knows. And if you think forward air is the best move, we just got it there too, so. We're getting close, we're getting close. And now we have Incineroar. Again, to nobody's surprise, it's side B. There we go, side B, perfect. And now we're on to the DLC. Does it shock anyone that Plant's best move is the Patui? His neutral B? And probably not. Oh my god, imagine if I got that though. That would have been so funny. Yes! We got it! <laughs> okay. I fished for it, but I got it. I don't care anymore. I am happy. I am at peace. Guys, did you know Joker has a gun? He's gonna grab me and he's gonna throw me out. Oh no. We can definitely do it. I believe. There we go. We got it with the gun. All I had to do was just sit here and hold B. So we can all agree Hero's best move is his spellbook, right? Like his down B. Because he has 21 separate moves. The thing is, I already did a video in getting a kill with every single one of the spells. Uh, also, how do you distinguish which one of that 21 is the best? So, therefore, I'm going to be going for just neutral B. Because I think his neutral B is incredibly good. He should be dead. There we go. 
Do you guys like my banjo impression? Oh, I didn't even say what I was going for. Oh yeah, yeah, banjo's best move. Some might say it's Wonderwing, and you know, you can make an argument for that. The only issue is that it's limited by uh, five uses, right? However, I think a lot of people would actually argue that his uh, his down B is that his poop grenade. Dude, I actually can't do anything. I actually just can't do anything because they keep... Yes! Yes! I got it! Yes! Fuck you, Pichu! Fuck you! <laughs> oh, I don't care. I can lose. I can be a happy man. Oh god, we're done. We're done. This was the last character I needed to go back for. Anyways, I think the next character is Terrence. Terrence from Fatal Fury, his best move. You might think it's Power Dunk power geyser uh, it's not I, I i pretty much agree with this decision though it's his uh back side b so we're gonna we're gonna go for that no why please whoa whoa the most anticlimactic one against a sonic i'm i'm gonna be honest i really like byleth i i don't i get like yeah it's another fire emblem character and whatnot oh i did i can't i keep forgetting i need to explain what the best move is so uh, you know byleth has a lot of strong contenders for best move however one that i see consistently is actually nair so we're gonna go for that oh no i just realized i have to go back and get roy's jab and greninja's dash there we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. I thought I was going to die there, so I had to focus up, but we finally got it, which is great. Potentially the most hated character in all the game. Her best move is F Smash, which is stupid strong, I might add. So we're going to we're gonna go for that. Can you just fuck off? There we go. Jesus, thank God. It only took me nearly three stocks to get. At least I don't have to play any more Min Min. So Steve is interesting his best move is not necessarily like a physical move right it is him building blocks <gasps> oh i think that counted we're gonna count that <laughs> we are gonna count that i did not think that was actually gonna work especially on a ddd but here we are we're done with steve you know, I'm not the best with Steve. I just want to just want to spam the minecart because that's the funny move. All right, we are closing in <laughs> on the last five characters. Sephiroth, which is one of the coolest DLC characters we have. Some would argue it's his side B. Some would argue it's his massive fucking sword. But his best move is neutral air. This is fine. There we go. Got it. Oh, yes. Yes. On an awful map, we got it. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Oh Jesus, I'm about to pop a blood vessel. And Pyra and Mithra. I just played them for a challenge, so hopefully it's still fresh. Pyra's best move is her down air. Some would argue her up B, and I think I would be more inclined to agree with the up B. Her down air is just ridiculous though, so I, I, can, I can see an argument for up B and down air. We're gonna be going for down air. Oh no, well I got a B on accident as the spike. Okay, so he's not dead, but that's great. So I can do this. <laughs> Sweet, okay, we got, <laughs> okay, we got Pyra's down air. Now we have to switch to Mithra's neutral air. Oh, I got him with the up B. That's not really what I wanted though. Ah, uh, that counts. That counts. That was the last move I hit him with, thank god. So it's Kazi, uh, to no one's surprise, it's Electric Wind Godfist. <laughs> the thing is, I don't think Electric Wind Godfist itself can kill. Pretty sure it can't. So we are going to go for Wind Godfist. Obviously, Electric Wind Godfist is his best move. I just, I, you, you quite literally can't kill with it unless you're in stamina mode. Well, there we go. We got it. <laughs> oh, man. So we got Wind Godfist, and I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, so I caved and finally bought him. You know, after five years, finally have the roster. Sora's best move is his Nair. Oh, my God. I feel... Oh, I 
feel scummy for playing Sora. This is I'm I'm having as much fun as I was expecting playing this character. I'm dead. This is so fun. This is so fun. I just, I love playing Sora. I love playing Sora so much. Oh, thank God I got it. Oh, it was the first hit, but I don't care. Oh, but wait, I need to do my outro now. This was a challenge. <laughs> it was. At some point, I will be doing a sequel to this challenge, getting a kill with every character's worst move. And uh, if you enjoyed, let me know. Go check out my friend Carver on the web. I am uh, on one of his videos. Uh, I hope you guys have a great day now, whatever it may be. And I'm just going to SD because I hate this game. <laughs> I just hate this character. All right, peace.